Hello Nuggets. Okay, so remember how I said we were only a few injuries away from uh, potentially it going wrong? It hasn't gone wrong, but it's getting a bit pear-shaped. Maybe a little bit wobbly. Um, so I've only played three games, but let me show you what happened. So, uh, we played Billericay, it's the last one you saw. We played Dartford next. So I rotated the squad out a little bit, because it looked like an easy win. And uh, look at this. It went mad. So we went 1-0 up. They had a man sent off after 16 minutes. I thought, well, lovely. You know, our, um, our secondary squad, they're not really secondary, but our rotated squad should be able to deal with this. Then on 10 men, they equalize. I'm like, okay, got to push up a little bit. Let's go to attacking. So we go to attacking. Depot finally gets one in, scores with his head, which seems to be the way he gets goals now. Great. 2-1 up, 10 men. Then they come back right on the stroke of half time. 2 all. We then play a majority of the second of half with them on nine men as they get another guy sent off. And we just cannot score. Then we get Zion Hakim, that lovely winger that we love so much that we're not playing enough, apparently, gets sent off. And then right at the end, Sam Squire gets sent off. So four sendings off and it's a two-all draw with the team. And the whole reason that I even rotated the squad was to rest the players so they're not in danger. But because I was getting so frustrated that we weren't winning a game, we should clearly be winning and definitely be winning against nine men. Unbelievable. I brought on the subs who needed a rest. So as far as the game is concerned, they weren't rested, even though they only played 30 minutes of football. So then we played St. Albans, scraped to win. <laughs> Absolutely scraped it. Another team that, frankly, we should have hammered. I think they're in 16th or something. They're not good. We should have hammered them. We scraped to win. And then we scraped a loss against Truro. So it's looking like we might have gone off the boil a little bit. You know, we're still in first place because basically down to some fortunate results. Um, Oxford aren't, uh, didn't do too well. Eastbourne have gone up the table a little bit. Um, our next game is against Oxford, uh, against Oxford. That's why I brought you back. I thought this will be a good match. But then I looked at Oxford and I think they're really overperforming. Their uh, media prediction is 20th. Um, so I don't know, and I looked at their squad, they don't look that good, but with the way we've played the last three games, I don't know. It's entirely possible that we're gonna get absolutely slaughtered. Um, so we'll see. So here's the squad. Uh, the other thing is, oh, Georgiou has been out last match and this match on international duty. Apparently he plays for Cyprus. They didn't, did they play him? I think they did play him, but he didn't do very good. Uh, but he's back after this match. Anyway, good for him, mate. Look at that, under 21 caps, his first cap. Very cool. Um, so I've tried a few uh, things here. I tried do dropping Depot back. Cameron Peters has just been horrible. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with him, but he just cannot put the ball in the net. Um, Lewis Price I've had playing in one match. He actually looked pretty good. I liked him. Um, overall, the team's the same. I've actually had to drop Nathan Green and brought in the other Nathan, Wait, is it Nathan Green? What's his name? Yeah, we've got a lot of Nathans. I just noticed that. The other Nathan, Malvia, my nemesis. Just because Green is just, I don't know what's going on with him. He's just playing terrible football right now. Absolutely terrible. He's not playing. I mean, they aren't the greatest attributes, but he's playing even worse than this. So he's out. Malvia's in. Um, I'm just going to give, hopefully, I'm, I'm going to put Green on the bench for one game. And I'm hoping that sorts him out and he comes back strong. Uh, we're giving Ming a run out, but other, other than that, it's pretty much the same. Giving Squire a run out because uh, Ferguson didn't play that well and he needs a, I think he needs a bit of a rest. Um, and also Karu, I'm going to try him as advanced playmaker. I think he's better as a DLP, defensive, but um, or a deep line playmaker rather. But I want to give him a go, get him a little bit further up front to see if he can cover the fact that our number 10 is not a striker. Uh, he's a playmaker as well. So I don't know how these two will work together. Um, but I'm also a little bit on the edge of dro of dropping um, this tactic. I don't know. I don't know. It, it feels like it's just quite not working. But that might just be down to the fact we don't have a very good striker. Uh, anyway, we're going to give Depot another run. Hopefully, I mean, he did, he did put a goal in last game. So we'll see. All right, here we go. Who are we playing? It's uh, Oxford City. That's right. See, look, they're, they're okay. They're not looking great. Right? 
It should be easy, I would think. I didn't show you the bench. It's the standard. You've seen them all before. Uh, let's see. Pollock. Anyone else there we recognised? Anyone else that we tried to steal at some point? Nope, don't think so. Hmm. What do we say here? Media have been praising you a lot lately. That was I don't know why did I say that? That was stupid. We'll go back to Daddy Cool goes back to his usual. Alright. I hope this isn't the start of the downward slide. Although I was actually thinking about it, and you know, I don't think I want to get promoted this season. Even if we had a chance. I, I, I like I obviously I want to get to Oh, I want to get to the playoffs because I want to please the board, get that out of the way. But I need to fix the finances of this team. And if we get promoted, firstly, I've got to renew contracts. I don't think... Oh, Caru lined them up. Third one's going in. Guarantee it. I don't think that, um, that the board are going to give me that much more money if we go up, right? And their expectation will be fight against relegation. But I'd rather not ping backwards and forwards. I would rather stay in this league... Get another expectation next year of making playoffs, but be able to fix the budget because I think I can keep a lot of these players. Clunis, come on! Oh my God, Clunis! Can't strike. Um, I think I can keep a lot of these players and reduce their wages and fix it so that we're actually building some money up and we're not running in debt, so that I can sign a decent player. You know, I still don't need to pay money. We can still get good transfers, free transfers. You know, and we can start nurturing our young talent along and maybe get some kids in and stuff like that. But going up would really compromise me. God, there we go. Send him off. Balling. He'll be balling in a minute. You ball in now, mate. Come on, we got to win. We, we, we didn't win against 10 men last time, which was truly disappointing. Caru, look at his delivery. It's exceptional. Really is. Shouts. Get creative. Do something, boys. Do something. So, yeah, going not going up is actually preferable. <laughs> it genuinely is. I mean, if we go up somehow, all right, we'll, we'll, we'll deal with it. But, I, you know, I'd, I'd rather take it a little bit slower. <clears throat> Price. Oh, you see, he's not... He's too young. He's too young for the responsibility. Shut him down. Ten men. It's ten men. Oh, you see, I think this just shows how we're just out. I feel like our run of form is definitely coming to a close. We're playing 10 men. I mean, they're in second, but they're really out outperforming. Nice one block. Come on, boys. Who's having a stinker? Caru is having a boring match. What is going on? 10 men. That's insane. How can we not be beating 10 men? I mean, there isn't that much more I can do. I've got, <laughs> I've got five players up front. Four. I've got four players up front. Not good enough. Not good enough. And none of the players are like... They're all reasonably bad, but none of them are awful. You know, there's not one where you can say, like, oh, well, look, it's Malvia. He's, he, he let them in. That's why they scored. They're all just kind of there. Just kind of getting by. It's much better showing than you in the second half. Okay. See, I mean, look, what have we got? Oh, come on, Katru. Look at that delivery. It's got to go in. Clunis, look at that. And again, Carry. Go on, son. Clunis. Oh. Why does it keep going to him? Oh, it's not good enough, though. It's not. Hang on. Look, what have we got here? We've got Clunis not playing well. Carry not playing well. I don't have anyone who can go in where Clunis is. I mean, I can drop Cook over, but then I have to bring Hakim in for Cook. And Hakim is fucking terrible. Wait, do I have, um, hang on. let me just check here. Do I have uh, Cook playing the right? I do, I do. I 
how are we not beating 10 men? How are they outplaying us? Are they outplaying us? No. No, they're not, you see. We're just not sticking it in the back of the net. Oh, this is horrible. This is horrible. This is just disgusting. I'm disgusted. I think I have to bring... Peter's on. Well, the blood, they're going to go down nine men and we still won't score. So this happened two games ago and we still couldn't score. Do I bring Cameron on? I got it. I got it. Something's got to change it. Right? Oh, okay, Peter's. Come on. Come on, mate. You can do it. Attacking forward. Who else? Who's just stinking up the field? Clunas is stinking up the field. <sighs> Garou? No. Squire? Not really stinking it up. Chambers isn't doing great, but that's not our problem. I mean, unless... You know, maybe I need to go back to my 424. All right. Yeah, put two up front, get the early crosses in. This is ridiculous. I'm I'm worried about how we're going to beat nine men. What's wrong with this picture, people? Oh, hang on. What is wrong? Does anyone see the problem here? Team? Target man. What should we train? No, target man. Try and target man on attack. Um, anything else we need here? That should be all we need. That should be it. Oh, you know what? Yeah, hang on. Early crosses. Okay, come on. Confirm changes. Surely, surely. What is going on? Show some passion. It's embarrassing, lads. I'm not going to lie. This is an embarrassment. 1-0 down. It's not like we just need to try and get the winner here. We just need to equalise. Come on, Cook. Go on, Clunis. A little bit disappointed in you, mate. Not going to lie. There we go. There we go. There we go. Karu, yes. Squire. Okay, one all. Push on, lads. Push on. Push on. Get creative. You can do it. Don't get frustrated by it. Okay, good. Come on. Scraping. Scraping through these games. Go on, Ming. Squire, Karu. Karu, let one go, son. Oh! Unlucky, mate. Oh, fuck it. Very attacking. We're going. They do have nine men, right? Did I or did I miss something there? No, yeah, they have nine men. Nine men. Oh, thank God for that. Oh, they've got feel gutted though. They played so well with nine men. See, what I mean, we're scraping. We are scraping through. Nine men, and we can just about win. Ugh. God, what do we say about that? You know what? We don't say anything. Who's demotivated? Sam Squire. Cook. What do you expect, man? Nine men. What, do you want me to praise you? Ridiculous. All right, win. It's a win. It's a win. It's a win. Okay, how? Yeah, we'll praise you. We'll praise you. Because you actually, you know what? You want it. You want it. You want it. You want it. That's what matters. Okay. Let's see. What else have we got coming up now? Looks like we have a little break. I think there's probably cup matches that we're not in coming in. Georgiou comes back from international duty. That's exciting. Scouting meeting. Anything going on here? No. All right. Uh, we will bring you back for the next match. Right. Bye. 
Hello. All right. So we're about to actually play uh, the third qualifying round, the FA Trophy, and we drew uh, Cray. Um, so there's a local derby. They're from Bromley, just down the road. Um, so we're about to play them. Uh, so I thought I'd bring you back to show you that match. There's also a couple of things going on here. So one is that Dan Thompson, who I'd moved to the under 23s because he's a backup and he wasn't very good, was whinging about how many games he isn't getting, which is understandable. He hasn't got any games. So I told him to buy his time. Wasn't interested. I said, you know, I'm not going to be forced. He went, well, it's probably best I leave then. So he's on the transfer market. He doesn't realize that I would love that £140 a week. I mean, he's cheap, but he's not good enough anyway. So I've put him, actually moved him up to the main squad. Um, he is transfer listed. No one wants him. I've told him to go talk to people. And he wasn't, you know, often when you tell the player, go to speak to clubs, they have this response. They say, great, the sooner I'm out of here, the better. Uh, he wasn't like that. He just said, yeah, okay, I'll have a look around. Or something like that. But, but I don't know, it was interesting. So, I don't know, I might give him a run. You never know. Maybe I've been wrong about him. Um, I mean, he can't be doing any worse than we're doing, right? I keep saying that like we're losing. We're not losing. But I just feel it. I feel we're on the edge. God, I hope we beat Cray. Woo! Okay, so what else? So, uh, Georgiou's back. Thank God. Uh, I think we're going to stick with the four-two-three-one. even though I'm really tempted to do this. You know, to uh, obviously Central. But to go with that... Um, but I think we'll stick with the 4-2-3-1. Uh, uh, I want to bring in Green again. I want to give him another go. But he's on thin ice with me, I'm not going to lie. As much as I can't st stand Mavia, I, I mean, I've got to have someone who's performing and Mavia performs better. The problem is that when Green does perform, he does so much more, right? He's capable of scoring. He can knock in some great passes from this area here. He can drop a cross in that is anyone could put away you know even depot could put away um i'm gonna take in ferguson uh, oh hakeem's manager came and complained again and we just had exactly the same conversation i don't think he remembered it apparently but we had exactly the same conversation i'll leave caro as uh, advanced playmaker because honestly i think he played better last time he didn't score which he should have oh he did score he scored right at the end from a free kick but uh he was involved in the game i feel a lot more um Going to switch out Teddy Bloor for Ming. I'm actually going to leave my via so he can cover both spots, which will allow me to bring Thompson. Should I put Thompson on instead of Peters? Yes, I can do it. Peters hasn't been performing. Um, bring Thompson on. Sounds quite. Who else do we want to put on the bench? Vose, by the way, is not back from injury, but uh, I'm getting training fitness reports on him now, so I think he's pretty close. They said two to four weeks. Where is it? It says down here. Seven days to two weeks. You probably can't see that, can you? No. Okay, it says down here seven days to two weeks. But he's so unfit. Um, I would say that he maybe he'll be back mid-February. I would guess that he'll be playing again. Maybe earlier. I don't know how quickly he'll recover. Um, but that's a really good sign. We <laughs> badly, badly need him. Um, I'm so tempted to give Carlos another run. I'm going to do it. I'm going, to do, I'm going to give Carlos a run, and I'm going to put Bloor on the bench. Um, <laughs> now I'm second-guessing that, though, because the problem is, is I've got two wing-backs again. Okay, Bloor on the bench. We're, not, we're going to give Green a full run, even if he plays badly. I need, a, I need to put Hakeem on because I need a winger. Okay. Quay Taylor for defense, wing-back. Wingers, midfield. Do I want Wiggy in midfield or do I want Sam Squire? I think I want Sam Squire. Wiggy's a bit young. They've been suggesting I send him back down, but I don't know how well they develop when you do that. And then Thompson on the bench. Thompson, maybe I'll give you a run out. If I want to sell him, he needs to play. Okay, let's do it. What do you think you are? You probably think you're another target. Yes. Why do they always think they're target men? I think it's so they don't have to face the consequences well, it's not my job to put it in. All right, where are we? Ready to play? Oh, oh, I didn't mean to pass on that. We're uh, also about to move into a new stadium. I don't know how I missed that. You probably saw it. <laughs> but um, Champion Hill Stadium. We completed the current ground share arrangement. Now in position to play at Champion Hill Stadium. Let's have a look at it. Under soil heating? No. Roof? No. Grass? Yes. 
it has a pitch. Pitch condition is good, which is a little worrying. I think it would be excellent, but I guess it's not a new stadium. I don't know why we weren't in here before. It's with Crystal Palace. It's Crystal Palace's under 23's ground. And we're currently in, I mean, it's a step up. It's a step up anyway. Wait, actually, 3,000 supporters with the potential for expansion to 5,250. All right. Uh, there you go, Dominic Vo's fitness test. So he's coming. He's coming back. I don't know why it sends me this. It doesn't even tell us he's in training. It's just a fitness test, I guess. Okay, board confidence update. Yeah, they're still happy. They don't know the ship. We're actually in hidden under the surface. I don't want to see about the cup. All right, Cray. Surely we are going to do it against Cray. Let's go. Nervous boys. Nervous. Cray, it's a local derby. I like that. Uh, team talk. What do I say? You should be winning this one fairly comfortably. And I don't care that you're not happy about that. I'm not going to say anything to boost your morale. You need to start taking responsibility for the crap you've been playing. All right, Thompson, you're on. Go earn some points and you'll get that transfer you're after. All right, boys, shut them down, shut them down, shut them down. Let's not have any first-minute goals from them. Okay, good. I didn't scout them. I just assumed they're bad there. I don't know what league they're in. They're in. They're, they're lower than Vanarama South, so... Are we making chances? Are we doing anything? We've got one shot on target, a couple of long shots. We arranged extra time. Uh, they give you that option of replay or extra time. Both sides always take extra time. I think I've had one situation before in previous saves where the other team said, no, we want to replay. They're obviously broke. For f I mean, that's just... Who is that? Edwards. That's Carlos, man. Just drifted. Well, he was in the... You know what? He was in the right position. He just screwed up see I'm okay with that it's he should have done better but it's not as frustrating as when they're on the wrong side of the pitch all right Caro nice delivery nice delivery out to Carlos you better be making up for what you just did Clunis cross it in Chambers to okay back to Carlos Clunis come on just dinking it around get the ball in there Ferguson, nice ball, nice ball, Edwards, good cross, son. Go on, Cook! Clunis, look. That's how you strike a ball, son. Ooh, his cook is so streaky, though. Good match, bad match, good match, bad match. Might get sent off match. See, look, he's wound up, furious, calm, happy, angry. I think he might be bipolar. I think that's what it is. Get creative. Let's see, does that wind him up? No, he's in spike. Thompson's uh, 6.8 and an assist. I might have been wrong about him. I just put transfer listed because uh, the argument we had and uh, yeah, he might be our best striker. Although then maybe I could sell Depot. <gasps> How dare I? Not good enough. 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 I seem to be saying this a lot to them. You can tell them how crappy they are. Maybe we go 4-2-4. I was about to say Georgie's playing badly, but he just picked up a little bit. He did crap on his international duty. Didn't do anything. They played in the first match. He got 6.5, I think it was, and then they just dropped him. I know how they feel, mate. Oh, for, come on. Nothing happening. One clear-cut chance against this non-league. I mean, we're non-league too, but... All right, green. That's Georgiou. To Caru and to Ferguson. Go on, son. Beautiful ball, Edwards. Drop it in, son. Go on. Go, oh, Georgiou.
she's just, this just keeps happening over and over. No one's playing terrible. We just can't put the ball in the back of the net. If I move you up a little bit, let's put you on attack, Mazzala. Attack, attack. Let's try you as a shadow striker. Attack. We're going to do wing back attack. I mean, we're going for it, right? We're going for it. Wing back attack. We're attacking. That should be it. That should be it. That's all you got. I mean, we might lose, but maybe you need the shame. Oh, the shame of a loss to this side. To pick you up a little bit. Nice block, block. Oh, for f... What's wrong? What? What the hell was that? <sighs> Getting knocked out by a non-league side is pretty bad. It's pretty bad, boys. Doesn't get more embarrassing than that. You know what? Hang on. We're going to this screen. Ay, 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 ay. Georgie, you're not playing well enough, mate. Thompson, let's bring Depot on. Let's swap these two. Hang on. Swap these two. Depot, target man support, you can keep as your poacher role. No, no one's playing that bad. They're all just playing me. So disappointing. So disappointing. <sighs> Three one. Go on, Cook. Have a run. Pull a point back, please. Nice run, son. Look at him go. Good ball, too. Oh, unlucky. That's unlucky. All right, Cook. Come on. Come on. Let it go. Let it go. Cook's doing his best. I wouldn't be surprised if he punches one of his own players. This is tremendously disappointing. I'm not going to lie. This is the worst result of the season by far. How are we losing to this side? Come on, Thompson. Do it. Yes! Thompson wants to get sold. Thank you, son. Ah, oh, we're sticking on very attacking. Come on. Get a winner. Are we going to extra? Ay, 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 ay. Yeah, go on then, try it. Start extra time. How are we letting them take us to extra time? Good news is, I have a couple of subs. So let's see, who can we bring on? Um, who's tired? Ashley's, Ashley's tired, so we'll bring on Squire for you. How's Ferguson? He's tired too, but Caru's worse. Squire will bring you on, and we're going to have you as the Carrillo. Um, Carrillero, rather. Carrillo. Pff, Carlos is knackered. Blur, you can come on for him. That's it. Do we get an extra one? I don't need this, but do we get an extra one for uh, extra time? No. The rules for this particular... Oh, nice tackle. Go on, Cook. The, the, the substitute rules in this the Vanarama South and this competition are annoying. Why five subs on the bench? Why not seven? Why not ten? I don't get it. I don't get why you ever need to limit that. Let the fans see all of the players and the managers sometimes forced into a certain formation they have to play. You know, the, just... Who was that? Chambers. I was about to take you off as well, mate. Oh! I don't think you should be limited to five subs. I don't... I don't know. I don't see the benefit to it. It's If it's some tactical, strategic thing in football 
It's like it makes it more difficult than the manager. That's fine, but it's a it's a it's a spectator sport. We don't care. The fan doesn't give a shit if there's only five players on the bench. They want as many players as they can on the bench. They, I mean, I don't mind being limited to three choices. It just bugs me that you're just shuffling players around and looking for people who can cover multiple positions. It just doesn't seem like an entertaining part of the sport to me. Okay, three, two up. I hate that against this team that we have to kind of think of taking our foot off the gas a little bit because they might score against us. Get another one and we'll completely take our foot off the gas. Oh, he's knackered. Look at them. Poor sods. Poor sods are exhausted. Green's, Green's had a better game today. Not great, but better. Cookie's had a cookie day. Cook. Back to Green. Come on, nice delivery. See, that's a great cross. Clunis. Dispossessed. What time to get dispossessed? Okay. All right, Clunis. Yes, sprinting it wide. Depot out again. Green. Early crosses, son. In there. Oh, whew. all right. Eight minutes. Eight minutes. Eight minutes. They've had a lot of yellow cards. Holy shit. They get fined for that, right? We're on the edge as well. Oh, no, 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 no. Get it out, out. Get rid, son. All right, we're almost there. One minute. One minute. Hold on, lads. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Out. Hold on. Oh, Depot's got it. Yes, we're okay. Nice one. Hard fought victory. So now what do I say to them over this one? Well played? Or do I say you were lucky? I mean, this, <laughs> their team's bad. Bloor, Cookie, he's looking tired. That's all right, mate. You had a good game. You had a great game. Oh, glancing at it from Depot. Okay, so that worked pretty well, that formation, didn't it? I think. Appreciate their efforts. All right, I don't really think I can look at them right now, so you better handle that. Good display, you know, we didn't. Hey, we got 5K. All right. Around of the first round. Cook on form. Yes, well done, Cook. 8.7. He was on a 9. Why did he drop off? Probably because he got tired. Okay, anything else? All right. Let's take a look at the schedule. Where are we at? Just a couple of days. I think we're going to end it there. It's been a long episode. Starting to get worried. As you can see, you know, scraped win. Scrape draw, scrape win, scrape loss, scrape win, scrape win. It's going to start coming apart. We should be getting better, and we're not getting better. We're getting worse. And we're early in the season. If we look at the, uh, you know, we're five points clear and the game in hand. It looks so good, doesn't it? And I'm really happy with it. I just know we're on the edge of something bad here. Uh, all right, I'll probably play a few games from this schedule. I don't see any reason to have you sticking around through this what's unknown if there's a if we have a I'll bring you back for the cup match definitely if that is in there as it should be um, alright you little nuggets thanks for watching see you in the next one cheerio